a number of years back or, or several years back uh, uh, because of our reporting um, a, a team of, uh, of reporters uh, uncovered a uh, uh, government corruption in Collier County and it resulted in a uh, uh, investigation called by the governor uh, indicted three of our elected county commissioners three of the five indicted uh, the, the uh, county manager, a couple of uh, private businessmen, and uh, led to uh, basically an ethics reform, definitely in our county, that's kind of spread or, or has been pointed to by the rest of the state. So it, it made a, a, a major, major uh, 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 change in the way government worked in, uh, in our county. I hope we always stay relevant, that the, the, uh, our community uh, newspapers, our, our newspapers in the community uh, always stay relevant. Uh, we, uh, we are inter it's an election year, and so we're interviewing uh, candidates for uh, endorsement. And there's a congressman, or there's a congressional seat that includes Miami and Naples, so it, it crosses the, uh, the state. And most of the, since most of the voters are in Miami uh, area, uh, uh, the, uh, the candidates uh, still come over to uh, see us and, and interview with our editorial board. But uh, one of the candidates that we had uh, last week uh, told us that uh, he's, not, he's, he's glad that uh, he got the interview with the Naples Daily News. And the Miami Herald just isn't relevant to uh, Dade County and Miami area anymore. We asked him, well, why? And he said, they're scared of their readers. They don't listen to them. And he said, uh, once a newspaper is scared of its readers, it quits being a newspaper. And I don't know, it's been a week ago, and I still think about that. It's, uh, it's an interesting point of view. Hey, truth, justice, and the American way. I, I read a lot of DC comics back in the 1950s, so. Uh, it, you know, we're talking Batman and, and Superman, and uh, uh, but if if you really are interested in truth, justice, and the American way, what what better profession than journalism? Certainly not politics.